Hello everyone, and welcome to Quantify's presentation on the basics of calculating and estimating concrete. In this presentation, we will discuss introductory concrete terminology and cover cost analyses for competitive tendering. Be sure to watch our other presentations for further information on various elements in the built environment. Concrete is composed of cement, sand, stone and water, and can be mixed on site or ordered from a supplier as ready-mix concrete. Concrete is measured, mixed, or sold in cubic meters. The grade, or strength of concrete is determined by the proportions of the ingredients. The combined proportions of ingredients in concrete are commonly known as a mixed ratio, for example, 1, to 2, to 4. The ratio sequence is always, cement, sand, and lastly stone. Therefore the volume of the mixed ratio, will read as follows. 1 part cement, to two parts sand, four parts stone. Cement is purchased by mass, that is, in pockets of 50 kilograms, or in bulk. The assumed weight, of one cubic meter of cement is 1,515 kilograms. So, 1,515 kilograms divided by 50 kilogram pockets, equals 30.3 pockets per cubic meter. Therefore, 50 kilograms divided by 1,515 kilograms, equals 0.033 cubic meters per pocket. Sand and stone, are purchased in cubic meters. When purchasing sand and stone, the material delivered will have voids or spaces between the aggregates. During the mixing process, voids between the aggregates are removed, with cement acting as the binder. Let's consider two methods used to make an allowance for voids, known as bulking and shrinkage. Bulking, assumes an increase in dry material to allow for voids. For example, assume a bulking of 30%, therefore 1.3 cubic meters of dry material, will yield 1 cubic meter of mixed concrete. Shrinkage, assumes a reduction in the yield as an adjustment for voids. For example, assume a shrinkage of 30%, that is, 1 cubic meter divided by, open bracket, 1 cubic meter, less 0.3 cubic meters, close bracket. Therefore 1.43 dry mix, will yield 1 cubic meter of mixed concrete. To calculate the cost of 1 cubic meter of concrete, we require, or need to make assumptions on the following information. Materials specified as part of the concrete mix, that is, cement, sand, stone etc. The mix ratio of the concrete, that is, the proportions of cement, to sand, to stone. For example, 1, to 2, to 3, or, 1, to 3, to 5 etc. Position of work, that is, foundations, beams, columns, multi-story etc. This will affect the distance and conveyance method of the concrete. Method of mixing, mixing by hand or by means of a mechanical mixer. Size and cost of the concrete mixer. Purchasing ready mix concrete, or mixing concrete on site. Method of bulking, or shrinkage of materials to account for voids, which can be assumed and calculated as a percentage. Hoisting method, if the building is multi-story, or has beams, columns, etc. Method of leveling the concrete. Water supply, this will be covered in your preliminary and general costs. Method of finishing concrete. Labor is required to mix, convey, and place concrete. Labor is also required to vibrate, and finish the concrete once it has been placed in position. Mixing of concrete can be carried out by hand, or using a mechanical mixer. Let's consider mixing concrete by hand. Assume the following. 5 laborers mixing, 3 laborers loading, and wheeling, 2 laborers placing. The above gang can mix 1 cubic meter per hour. Therefore the labor constant is total time divided by total production. So, 10 multiplied by 1 hour divided by 1 cubic meter equals 10 hours per cubic meter. Therefore, one laborer will mix, load, wheel, and place 1 cubic meter in 10 hours. Let's consider mixing concrete by machine. Assume the following. 400 liter mixer. Shrinkage factor 30%, that is, 400 liters in, divided by, 100 divided by 70, equal 280 liters, or 0.28 cubic meters yield. Mixing time of 5 minutes per batch, that is, 60 minutes, divided by 5 minutes, multiplied by 0.28 cubic meters, which equals 3.36 cubic meters per hour. 10 laborers mixing, loading, wheeling, and placing. Therefore the labor constant is 10 multiplied by 1, divided by 3.36 cubic meters, equals 2.98 hours per cubic meter. To cover the cost of handling cement, 
we can add 10% to the labor rate, multiplied by the number of pockets. When working with concrete that requires reinforcing, add one labor hour per cubic meter. Where concrete structures are of a confined nature, for example, columns, walls, beams etc., two labor hours per cubic meter can be added. Small restricted items such as steps, shower curbs etc., 20% can be added to the labor rate. Hoisting of material using conveyors, hoists, cranes etc., can be covered in the preliminary and general section. Where the height of the concrete works exceed 3 meters, the following multiplier factors can be applied. 3 to less than 10 meters, multiplied by 1.1. 10 to less than 15 meters, multiplied by 1.2. Add 0.1 for every additional 5 meters. To tender accurately, contact your local suppliers for current rates and substitute your local currency into the analysis. For this exercise, let's use the South African Rand and assume the following. Cost of cement at 80 rand per pocket. Sand at 185 rand per cubic meter. Stone at 230 rand per cubic meter. Labors are paid for a 9-hour day, which includes an hour's lunch. A gang leader at 648 rand per day. Cost of operator at 486 rand per day. Cost of general laborer at 405 rand per day. Concrete mixer at 450 rand per day. Drive unit and poker at 270 rand per day. We are now equipped to use the above information and assumptions to accurately price a cubic meter of concrete in a surface bed. Let's assume the following. Unit of measure, cubic meters. Concrete mixing waste, 5%. Mix ratio, 1, to 2, to 4, that is 7 parts. 400 liter cement mixer, with a shrinkage factor of 30%, that is, 400 divided by, open bracket, 100 divided by 70, close bracket, which equals 280 liters, or 0.28 cubic meters. Mixing cycle of 5 minutes per batch, that is 60 minutes divided by 5 minutes, multiplied by 0.28 cubic meters, which equals 3.36 cubic meters per hour. 10 laborers, one of which is the operator, who earns 20% more. Using the layout for a cost analysis, with columns for resources, unit of measure, quantity, rate and amount, we can now calculate the cost of a cubic meter of concrete. Cement, one part, divided by seven parts, multiplied by, 400 liters, divided by 280 liters, multiplied by, 30.3 pockets per cubic meter, multiplied by 80 rand per pocket of cement, equals 494 rand and 40 cents. Sand, two parts divided by seven parts, multiplied by, 400 divided by 280, multiplied by 185 rand. Stone, 4 parts divided by 7 parts, multiplied by, 400 divided by 280, multiplied by 230 rand. Handling of cement, at 6.18 pockets of cement, multiplied by, 10% of the laborer's hourly rate. Concrete mixer, divided by 3.36 hours per cubic meter, multiplied by 50 rand. Drive unit and poker, divided by 3.36 hours per cubic meter, multiplied by 30 rand. An operator, divided by 3.36 hours per cubic meter, multiplied by 54 rand. Nine laborers, divided by 3.36 hours per cubic meter, multiplied by 45 rand. Lastly, we add mixing waste on all the above items of 5%. The net cost for a cubic meter of concrete, is therefore 994 rand and 77 cents per cubic meter. Let's work through an analysis for a reinforced concrete beam, 24 meters high. Let's assume the following. Unit of measure, cubic meters. Concrete mixing waste, 5%. Mix ratio, 1, to 2, to 2, that is 5 parts. 400 liter cement mixer, with a shrinkage factor of 40%, that is, 400 divided by, open bracket, 100 divided by 60, close bracket, which equals 240 liters, or 0.24 cubic meters. Mixing cycle of 10 minutes per batch, that is 60 minutes divided by 10 minutes, multiplied by 0.24 cubic meters, which equals 1.44 cubic meters per hour. 10 laborers, one of which is the operator, who earns 20% more. Cement, one part, divided by 5 parts, multiplied by, 400 liters, divided by 240 liters, multiplied by, 30.3 pockets per cubic meter, multiplied by 80 rand per pocket of cement, equals 808 rand. Sand, two parts divided by five parts, multiplied by, 400 divided by 240, 
multiplied by 185 rand. Stone, 2 parts divided by 5 parts, multiplied by, 400 divided by 240, multiplied by 230 rand. Handling of cement, at 10.1 pockets of cement, multiplied by, 10% of the laborer's hourly rate. Concrete mixer, divided by 1.44 hours per cubic meter, multiplied by, the height multiplier factor of 1.4, multiplied by 50 rand. Drive unit and poker, divided by 1.44 hours per cubic meter, multiplied by 1.4, multiplied by 30 rand. An operator, divided by 1.44 hours per cubic meter, multiplied by 1.4, multiplied by 54 rand. Nine laborers, divided by 1.44 hours per cubic meter, multiplied by 1.4, multiplied by 45 rand. Add an additional hour for working around reinforcing, and add two hours for working on confined structures. Lastly, we add mixing waste on all the above items of 5%. The net cost for a cubic meter of concrete, is therefore 1,879 rand and 74 cents per cubic meter. Lastly, let's work through an analysis for a reinforced concrete column, 10 meters off a bearing level, using ready-mix concrete. Let's assume the following. Unit of measure, cubic meters. Concrete mixing waste, 5%. Concrete grade, 30 megapascals, in columns, 10 meters high. Three laborers, one of which is a gang leader, who earns 60% more. A concrete boom pump, can be included with preliminary and general costs. 30 megapascals slash 19 millimeters stone concrete, multiplied by the supplier's rate of 1,250 rand per cubic meter. Application waste of 5%. Drive unit and poker, multiplied by 9 hours, divided by 6 cubic meters per day, multiplied by, the height multiplier factor of 1.2, multiplied by 30 rand. A ganger, multiplied by 9 hours, divided by 6 cubic meters per day, multiplied by 1.2. Two laborers, multiplied by 9 hours, divided by 6 cubic meters per day, multiplied by 1.2. Add an additional hour for working around reinforcing, and add 2 hours for working on confined structures. The net cost for a cubic meter of concrete, is therefore 1,793 rand and 10 cents per cubic meter. And that concludes Quantify's presentation on basic concrete theory and cost analyses. Thank you for watching. Be sure to watch our other videos on various other topics in the built environment.